So let's go over how you can change the perspective of an object using Inkscape. For this demonstration, I'll be using a text object. So I'm gonna grab my text tool and I'm gonna to click on the canvas and I'm just gonna use the word perspective for this demonstration. And then I'm gonna grab my selection tool and I'm gonna make this a little bit bigger so you can see it better. Now what we wanna do is open up our path effects menu. So I'll come up here to where it says path and I will select path effects. Now in order for this function to work, the object that we're applying it to has to be a path. Right now, this is just a text object. So let's convert this to a path by going to path, object to path. And once you've done that, you should be able to click on this little plus icon down here in the menu to add a new path effect. And the path effect that we're looking for is called perspective envelope, which is located right there. If you're having trouble accessing it, you could just type it into the search bar up here, P-E-R-S, and there it is, perspective envelope. And now all you have to do is grab your Edit Paths by Nodes tool. And if you look in the corners over here, you will see these four white nodes and you can take these nodes and use it to change the perspective of your object just like that. Now, if you wanna lock the perspective onto a certain axis, you can use these settings over here in the Path Effects menu. So if I select Mirror Movements in, on the horizontal axis, it'll make it so that the perspective only changes relative to the horizontal axis like that, as you can see there. And likewise, if you use Vertical, it'll lock the perspective change onto the vertical axis like that. And once you are finished, you can finalize the changes by going to path, object to path, and you are done. That is how you can change the perspective of an object using Inkscape. If you found this lesson useful, then consider checking out my Inkscape Masterclass. It's a collection of over 60 videos where I go over all of the tools and features in Inkscape, and I explain what they are and demonstrate how they work. Kind of like how I did in this video. We even have a private community where you can ask questions and get help from me anytime you want. And best of all, there's no monthly membership fees. You just pay $17 one time and you're in for life. I'll have some information about that down below if you want to check that out. As always, thanks for watching.